Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you in PHP using PDO objects how to insert multiple selected checkbox values into MySQL PHP My Admin Database with stored procedure. I'm reloading the browser. Now I'm selecting the sports, boxing, running, and volleyball. I have selected three checkbox controls. Before click the submit button, let's check the table browse right now this table contains only one row cricket and volleyball let's insert this selected checkbox values submit see so here we got a message the records inserted successfully let's check browse and notice those selected values from checkbox controls is inserted successfully in this sports table using stored procedures in php if you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. Before writing the coding part in PHP, first we will create a new table and store procedure in MySQL PHP My Admin Database. Notice in this panel sample DB which is a database. I am creating a table in this sample DB database. SQL create table sports is a table name id int not now auto increment column and i'm adding primary key comma sp name is a sports name var 250 let's create a table table is created successfully and you can notice in the sample db database in the tables folder the sports table is here let's browse the table right now this sports table contains zero rows let's insert the values with multiple checkbox controls in php using store procedures so let's create a new store procedure in the sample db database procedures to create a procedure, click add routine. The stored procedure name is SP Sports. It's a stored procedure name and the type is a procedure. And the parameters, the direction is in. The name is a sports. The type, data type is a varchar. And the length is 250. After adding the parameters, now I am writing the definition which is a insert statement. Insert into the table name is a sports, the column name and the column name SP name values between back codes. I'm adding this parameter name sports. That's it. Let's create a table. Go. And the stored procedure is created successfully. You can notice here at the bottom SP sports. Let's execute. I'm entering some values. The sports is cricket, volleyball. Click go. Let's browse the table sports. I'm opening the new link in a new tab and see the results of this sports table which contains the rows cricket and volleyball now let's write the code in php to insert multiple select checkbox values into this sports table i'm using notepad plus plus for this video tutorial now in this new one page i'm adding html i'm closing the html Header section, I'm closing the header. Next one is a body. I'm closing the body tag. Inside this body, I'm adding the center tag. Closing the center tag. H1. How to insert multiple selected checkbox values into my sql 
php php my admin let's close the history tag php pdo using stored procedure horizontal line now after the horizontal line I am adding some checkbox controls inside the table control let's add the table border is equals to 1 Close the table tr let's close this tr td I am closing this td the first td is a sports which is a cricket I'm closing this td now in this td I am adding the checkbox control input type is equals to checkbox value is equals to cricket name is equals to sports array let's close the checkbox control copy this let's add some more checkbox controls and this one is the volleyball the next sports is a um, boxing Tennis. and the last checkbox control name is money so after adding the checkbox control let's add after the table input type is equals to submit value is equals to submit name is equals to the button name is submit let's close the button control before writing the php code let's save this file i'm saving this file in the root folder www video checkbox insert store procedure dot php let's save this file we'll check the output the designing part on the browser and here we got the output of that code which contains a header tags and five checkbox controls with a button control after designing part and now we'll write the code to insert the selected checkbox controls when i click submit i want to save in this table using this stored procedure so let's go to the coding part first in the coding part let's add the form tag after the horizontal line add the form method is equals to post let's close the form tag add this form tag after the center tag after adding the form tag we'll write the coding part php first in this php i'm adding my connection string variables dollar host name is equals to local host dollar db name is equals to database name my database name is sample db dollar username is equals to root dollar password is equals to empty 
The password I'm leaving empty because I don't have any password to log in my SQL PHP my admin database. If you have any password, please enter that one. After that, we'll write the connection method dollar con is equal to new PDO objects. We are connecting the my SQL PHP my admin address so I'm adding the my SQL colon host is equals to the host is a host name dollar host name semicolon the next parameter is a DB name which is a database name dollar DB name let's put this into double quotes Come on. The next one is a username, dollar username, comma, dollar password, semicolon. After that, I'm adding the variable checkbox select is equals to dollar underscore post between single quotes. I am adding the checkbox controls name which is a sports. I am creating a variable chk is equal to empty. I am using for each loop to select the checkbox controls for each loop dollar checkbox select as dollar exports now I'm adding all the selected checkbox values into this variable dollar chk let's add this one dot is equals to dollar chk sports dot between double quotes comma semicolon Notice here, I have added the dot is equals to which means, which is nothing but I am concatenating the values. We are selecting multiple checkbox values. So I am concatenating all the values after that and separating those values using comma. Next, next we will write the query to call the store procedure dollar SQL is equals to between double quotes semicolon here I'm calling the store procedure name just copy this part from call to nine semicolon just remove this default parameter at p0 add our dollar check chk variable between single quotes That's it. We have inserted the selected checkbox values using this SP Sports store procedure. Dollcon execute method dollar SQL. Once the statement is executed, which means the record is inserted successfully, I want to display the message. Record. Bold records inserted successfully. Now the last one I'm adding if condition if is set dollar underscore post let's square back as I'm adding the button control ID submit between single quotes I'm closing this curly braces after the echo message that's it we have done the complete coding part let's save this file we'll check the output on the browser I'm reloading the browser now I'm selecting the sports, boxing, running and volleyball. I have selected three checkbox controls. 
before click the submit button let's check the table browse right now this table contains only one row cricket and volleyball let's insert this selected checkbox values submit see here we got a message records inserted successfully let's check browse and notice those selected values from checkbox controls is inserted successfully in this sports table using stored procedures in php that's it